Hi everyone and welcome to this video and if you're new, welcome to my channel. Uh, today we are going to play with a with lot of foundations. I saw a video today where Laura Lee, uh, she's a YouTuber, she took all of her foundation and mixed them together and she was uh, trying it out using that foundation that she got on her face and I was thinking I don't have the uh, same foundation as she does. I always buy full coverage foundations and uh, matte foundations. So I thought, how will my mix foundation look? So I took out all of my foundations and here are they. I think I have three foundations that I don't use anymore, but I st that I don't like at all. But I still want them in this video just to see what will happen with them when I mix all the foundations together. So if you want to see that, please keep on watching. Uh, I'm doing this on my chair together. So let's just start. There's some different shades of the same foundation. That's what I think I'm going to use this one to mix and maybe do it a little bit lighter. But uh, let's start. So this is what we got. Now I'm going to mix all of the foundations together. So we mixed everything together and this is what we have. Okay, so this is what we have to work with. I think the shade turned out very nice. Whew. That was a lot of the foundation. Let me see how many foundation I mixed. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. 22 foundations. I'm going to use this primer. This is a Too Faced Hangover Primer. I'm going to use this one because I uh, used a lot of or mixed a lot of matte, matte foundations. And they can be a little bit drying. So we're going to use this primer. I already did uh, this makeup look in another video, uh, but I want to do this one separately. Now, so I'm going to take this spatula that I mixed this foundation with and use that to apply the foundation on my face or spread the foundation on my face. Okay, shade's not bad. It looks a little bit, mm, I thought it would be a little bit thicker than it actually is, but we'll see how it's going to feel on my face. I don't know how much to use. This is enough for like six or seven people. I just used half of the pump of every foundation. I'm going to blend everything with a brush and I'm going to use my favorite foundation brush, brush from Paris Berlin. 
and uh, my hair is a little bit messy. Let's see. It has a very strong scent. I used a little bit too much, I can say that right now. Let me say what I think. I don't know if, how it looks on the camera, but here it looks very, very cakey and very heavy on my face, especially on my nose. It looks very cakey. I do not like it and I think that the reason is that I use a lot of full courage heavy foundations I don't know if you can see on my nose it looks very cakey doesn't look bad around here but nose looks like a disaster I'm going to do rest of my makeup and I'll be right back so I'm finished with my look and actually when I see myself in my mirror I like what I see I like the finish of this foundation my own mixed foundation and it doesn't look terrible now i did set it with this uh, product this remote uh, remote stay matte powder i forgot my words and i did and i did use this spray too now i can say it doesn't look bad but it does look heavy when you look very close it does look heavy and it does look a little bit cakey on the nose because it feel, it seems like I'm very dry today on my nose. Maybe that's the reason. But I really like the shade of, uh, of this mixed foundation. I really like how it looks and the whole makeup look turned out fine. So let's zoom in so you can see how it looks. So this is how it looks. Doesn't look bad at all. Just a little bit cakey on my nose, but we'll see. And right now it's 13:22, uh, so we are all going to have this foundation for a couple hours, and I'm gonna do check-ins and see how it will stay on my skin. Hi everyone, it's been around three hours now, and uh, this makeup or foundation looks wonderful from far away, but looks like a disaster very close it didn't start creasing or anything it looks so heavy in real life very close it looks a little bit cakey like it did before on my nose i don't know if you can see, you can see that it looks very heavy i mean this could be something that i will use when i film but not go outside really so i'll do another check-in after a couple of hours and see if it gets worse hi everyone <laughs> Okay, let's talk about how it looks. It's been around, I don't know where I should move. I don't know if you can see this light is not very good, but okay. It's been on for eight hours, this foundation. And I don't know if you can see, it doesn't, it looks a little bit cakey and it didn't crease or anything or break or something, but it looks so, heavy on my skin i can actually say it looks heavy now i'm a shiny as you can see in this light i'm very very shiny but it doesn't look good okay so would i do this again definitely not uh, but that was fun it was very fun to see what i created mixing with mixing all the foundations that was a interesting thing to do and it was funny but I won't do that again just because it looks too heavy and it's not uh, worth spending all that foundation for this look well that was everything thank you so much for watching and see you in my next video and see you in my next video bye